In this video, I will compare Bubble versus Go High Level and tell you which of these SaaS builders may be best for you and your needs. So I have experience with both of them and I currently actually use the Go High Level SaaS Pro plan. And in this video, I'll just explain their differences and tell you which one is best depending on your needs and experience. So Bubble is basically a full stack, no code app builder that allows you to build apps. And that could be some kind of a software that you sell to businesses. Now, Go High Level's SaaS Pro plan, on the other hand, is just a white label of Go High Level, and you can resell it as your own software. Now, there are quite some people that are doing that, and mainly the people will just focus on one aspect of Go High Level, such as the AI conversational bot, or their CRM, or a calendar, or funnels, and resell that to businesses. Now, there are people making hundreds of thousands of dollars in monthly recurring revenue by doing that. Now, on Bubble, there are also a lot of apps being built. You can see that over 4.6 million apps have been built on Bubble. So which one should you use for your SaaS? In my opinion, if you have no coding experience, even though Bubble is also no code, but if you just want the easiest option and the ability to really get started quickly, and even though it is easier, probably it is going to be better unless you want to have something really custom, but then go with Go High Level because it's just a pre-built package of softwares that is just really good and that you can resell at, for example, $97 per month. Now, it does come with a little bit of a more expensive price at $497 per month, comparing to Bubble, which has a free plan available. Although on the free plan, you cannot actually have your app live. For that, you need to get the starter plan at $32 per month, but the growth plan is recommended by them. This one is 134, then team is 399 and enterprise is custom. So if you have a specific software idea in mind that you would like to build, then you want to go with Bubble. But if you're looking for the easier option and you still want to have a really good software to resell, then go with Go High Level. Go High Level on Trustpilot, I think it has over 3.7 thousand reviews with 4.9 stars out of 5. So people absolutely love it and so, and they will love it as well if it is under your brand because it will basically be the same software, but just with the features that you are including and also at the pricing that you choose. Now, if you want to build a SaaS using Go High Level, you will need to have the SaaS Pro plan and you won't find this on their usual homepage. So I'll leave a link to this page down in the description and you can claim a 14 day free trial if you'd like to. And after that, it's $497 per month. So if you have five people paying $97 per month, you already make that back. But this is just a flat fee. You don't need to pay extra for anything. So it is just this, and I think it's definitely worth it. However, if you want to build something really custom, and you don't mind it taking a bit of time to build out your app, but you are looking to really build a really custom software again, then go with Bubble. Now, if you want to get started with Bubble, I'll also leave a link to them down in the description that will allow you to get started with building your app completely for free. So for building your own custom SaaS, go with Bubble. And for a pre-built software that you can resell that is really good, then go with Go High Level and the SaaS Pro plan. And again, I'll leave a link to this page down in the description. So that concludes this comparison of Bubble versus Go High Level. If this comparison was helpful, please consider leaving a like and subscribing to my channel. And with that being said, I will see you in the next video.